The goal of war is simple, to win. But searching for a way to win has kept many a general pacing and nail-biting at night. Winning requires an advantage in attacking cities or wiping out troops, defending cities or preserving troops, finding targets or learning the enemy's plans, or moving over air, land or sea. Since humanity has decided not to settle scores through arm wrestling matches, winning has required technology. Here are the top 10 game-changing military technologies in human history. Number 10. The Chariot. Before the advent of the chariot, men fought wars on foot. The first chariots, appearing around 3000 BC in Mesopotamia, were dreadfully slow and so heavy that only oxen could pull them. Chariots were the superweapons of their age. They trumped everything else and became the decider of warfare. Chariots spread from West Asia and Egypt to India, China and Europe. Soldiers packed into block formation and fought each other with stabbing and slashing weapons. Think of the chariot as an ancient tank. Number 9. Gunpowder. Gunpowder exploded into history around 800 AD. The Chinese accidentally invented it while trying to mix immortality elixirs. The Chinese government tried to keep gunpowder a secret, but it leaked to groups that attacked China and eventually the knowledge traveled across trade routes. Over 400 years, the Chinese made early versions of every gunpowder weapon to exist, including bombs, guns and a type of cannon called the Flying Cloud Thunderclap Eruptor. Number 8. Rifled Gun Barrels Guns of the time had smooth barrels, which sent bullets flying in all directions. You couldn't hit the enemy unless you were close. Back then, soldiers stood almost face to face and shot each other. But rifled guns, used widely starting in the 1800s, had grooved barrels. These guns spun the bullets, so that they traveled straight for hundreds of yards, vastly improving long-range accuracy. Rifled barrels changed naval warfare, too. Ship guns now had such range and accuracy that ships could fire at each other without seeing one another. Number 7. Internal Combustion Engine The internal combustion engine altered the speed and range of war, starting in World War I and continuing today. During World War I, machine gunners on the front lines had to wait for horse-drawn wagons to bring their ammunition from railheads, until supply trucks made the link. Without the internal combustion engine, steam engines could still power war. But these engines are only efficient enough to move ships or locomotives. War tactics would be stuck in the late 1800s if we still relied on steam. Number 6. Airplanes. Italy was the first to use airplanes for military purposes. Airplanes changed war by offering an alternative to land or sea invasion, so that fewer soldiers would occupy the battlefield and be at risk. By World War I, Germany, Austria, Hungary, France and Britain had air forces hundreds of planes strong. First, countries just sent planes to spy on their enemies. During World War II, both the military convenience and danger of air attacks became clear. To force Japan to surrender while avoiding a land invasion, the United States struck the main island by air. Number 5. Radio. Before radio, commanders could control big armies. They used runners, riders, flags and even pigeons to communicate, but just ask Napoleon how hard it was. As armies grew larger, the need for communication to maneuver them in the field became more important. Radio meant that a commander could be in instant contact with all of his subcommanders and organizations. Navies used wireless telegraphs, the first military radios, during World War I. These machines beamed messages from land stations to sea, without the need for wire, but enemies readily intercepted the messages and cracked the codes. Number 4. Microwave Radar Radar changed both offense and defense in war. It was the first automated way to see the enemy, but also to be seen. As late as World War I, watching for the enemy meant stationing a man in the field with field glasses and telling him to phone the commander when he saw a plane. Radar also changed war at sea. But airplanes, once outfitted with microwave radar, trumped the subs. Number 3. Nuclear Weapons 
nuclear weapons were used on people just twice. In 1945, the United States dropped two atomic bombs on Japan at the end of World War II. The little boy bomb carried fissionable uranium, and the reaction of just a fraction of it sent a shockwave, fireball and radiation across Hiroshima, killing 90,000 people. The Fat Man bomb carried fissionable plutonium, and its explosion immediately killed 35,000 people in Nagasaki. Number 2. Spy Satellites During the Cold War, the Soviet Union and United States found themselves in exactly the situation. The United States began the Discoverer spy satellite program to watch how fast the Soviet Union was making missiles and where they were being sent. Discoverer 4, the first US camera carrying satellite, launched in 1959 but didn't reach orbit, but Discoverer 14 went up in 1960 and returned photos. Number 1. Global Positioning System GPS turned the world into a giant, instantly accessible map. The U.S. Department of Defense built the U.S. version of GPS, Navstar GPS satellite, between 1989 and 1994. GPS became an excellent tool for navigation. A soldier with a receiver could now navigate in the pitch dark or in any foreign place without a map. Anyone with a receiver that can pick up a few satellites' waves can triangulate his or her position. That ends our tour of military technologies that changed the game, for better or worse. If you like this kind of content please like, share and subscribe.